Hey guys, and welcome to Poke Storm. So for today, we are going to be opening this new Arceus Collector's Chest. It's the same as the box or paper version that came out a few, probably weeks back before this one. Um, this is just your standard lunchbox version, and it does have the same promo cards and I think five booster packs. So we're excited to open this for you today. All right guys, so before we get into this, we actually compared it with a sealed version of the, I guess, paper or box. And you're actually getting a better deal, I think, with the paper one, because you do get seven packs. And you still get all three promo cards. And it looks like the only different thing is you get the mini binder in this. So I guess if you're really in And you do, I mean, it is a lunchbox, yeah. which is cool for the kids, right? It is, yeah. Because they don't really, you don't really see too many of the little old school, like retro lunchboxes anymore. So no, you really don't. This is a neat, I'll say item that the Pokemon company has started putting out. But if you're in it for the booster packs or the pulls or anything like that, you're getting a little more, I think, for your value with the paper one. Yeah, I mean, it definitely is cool to see this, like the imagery and I guess oh, and yeah. the little starters in the lunch box. The quality is definitely a little higher on this one for sure. Yeah, so let's go ahead and open it up. Oh, here we go. I do love these promo cards. Yeah, these are some of my favorite promo cards they've had in a long time. They're just really neat. And even the Arceus coin is cool too. And these had that really neat, almost like textured hollow pattern. Yeah, I don't really know what you would call this one actually. And then the Cyndaquil, I don't know. It's just, that is cool to me. Oshawott, Cyndaquil, and Rowlet. I don't know Pretty how cool. hard they are to get out of this because I really would like to. I might leave them in there for now. They will get sleek. Don't worry. They will get sleek. This is very fitting too with the upcoming release of. I know this is a brilliant star, more focused opening, but very fitting for uh, Astral Radiance. Yep, that's right. There we go. And Collective let's see chest. what little items we have in here. I think it's going to be literally identical to the other one as far as this stuff. So you got the. Arceus stickers, you got Cyndaquil, Oshawott and Rowlet, and the three starters, and the little notebook again that has kind of a little, like, I don't know, more geometric pattern. And then this looks to be the one item that's completely different. It's gonna be your mini binder, which is neat. I mean, mm -hmm. it is neat to at least get one of those, I feel like. Well, yeah. and it's different too from your, like, your regular Brilliant Stars mini binder. Right. That would actually be a neat, big like regular size binder it would be you know they keep saying they're coming out with an arceus one but the date i think has been moved numerous yeah, times it's getting pushed back it's i wish they'd put them out like when they put the sets out so you could have like a binder i'm gonna go ahead and do the fusion strike first um a binder that actually like matched your set i just think that'll be really i know kind of like as a as like a release a, for yeah like a nicer like ultra pro mm -hmm. binder i mean you always see the hardback binders but those can be a bit damaging to your cards. Uh, check out ones, Deep Pocket Monsters yeah. video on binder etiquette. It makes you think of them completely differently. Yes. And the ones that have like just the clear sleeves that are almost like the old school, like ones you would put your like projects for school in, those don't really protect the cards, I don't think, very well either. I really like the ones that have the black kind of background. Well, keep sand shrew i do like this little dig sand shrew dig it up dig it up dig it on, on, on. we got the whole sand shrew we got q fant impidimp oh sand, sand slash. slash nice and blissy you know i like that card <laughs> all right on to number two of fusion strike so two sets were still Working on the binder on. Mm -hmm. I think at this point, we're actually a little further along in Brilliant Stars than we are in Fusion Strike. Yeah, I think Brilliant Stars, we're definitely in the 70-some range as far as how many cards we still need. So. And that does include Reverse Hollows, Trainer Gallery cards, Alternate yep. Arts, everything. Yeah, exactly. Which is kind of funny. They don't even put out set lists like printed out, just easy to, I guess, check off type set lists that have all of that. Um, no. They're not, a lot of them aren't including the trainer gallery on those. They do in the actual little booklets that come in the ETBs. So we got a reverse Landorus and a Verizion. Well, all right. So other than our uh, promo cards, 
We don't have anything in our sleeve club. Granted, they're not sleeves, but they're- We do have the sleeves We ready. have them. Yes. I just don't want to mess them up and taking them out, so I'm going to be extra careful. And guys, stay tuned at the end of this video for a teaser for tomorrow's video. We mm -hmm. have something we've been kind of saving up here for a while. We got Skaters Park. If you watched our weekend Pokemon hunt, one of the things we found there may actually be a tease for that. Marsh Tomp. We got Totodile. Oh, can we get Feralia? Hunt. I know that would be kind of neat. Snorlax. Snorlax with his heavy impact. We got Snom. Find ice, which right now is hot enough. You need to find some ice. We got Dreepy. A Reverse Aracuda. And a Centiscorch. Centiscorch. So we that got a... nothing from the Fusion Strike. <laughs> At least no, no hollow rares. All right, Brilliant Stars. This is your moment to be a star. That's right. Be a star, baby. Let's see. Can we pull the Charizard alternate art? That is a card we're still looking for. Oh, we got the V-Star Maka. You're there a V-Star. Right V-Star. Team Yells Cheer. We got Marnie's Pride. Rottle. Milkery. Cub Choo. We got Diddy. We got Farfetched. The school. We got a reverse clang. And a Moltres. Oh, hollow Moltres. Hey, first member of the sleeve club today. That's actually going in a sleeve is right Moltres. now. Oh, did you see the cards that were released for um or I say revealed for Pokemon Go? I actually haven't seen very many of them yet. So there is a reverse. Oh, I cannot remember what it is. Anyway, it's a ditto that you peel off. Oh, I heard about it. It's like a sticker card. It's a sticker card. Uh -huh. Anyway, they, I, I, the Moltres reminded me of it because I think they showed a Pokemon Go like, mo oh, God, my words. Moltres, Zapdos, and Articuno. Oh, wow. And that was kind of, I want it, was it a Bidoof? That was the. I think it might be. I think that's right. I did see somebody tweet something about that. The I think, Pokemon, today. it's like almost like an experimental set. I know. I'm excited it's about cool. it too. We gotta, you know, we're gonna enjoy Astral Radiance first, but they're really putting them out close together, so we're gonna have a lot, lot going you know, on. I posted that poll the other day in the community tab, asking people which one they were looking forward yeah. more to. It's a close. It was a close one. We got a circle of eggs. And this is our last pack. It better have something good. Reverse Tornadus is going to be followed up by... Wow. A worm. Oh. A worm. <laughs> oh. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. No offense to the collector's chest, but this was a little bit of a rough, uh, a rough. Well, opening. our lone member of the, at least of the pulled sleeve club, is a hollow Moltres. But you know, we still. Oh yeah, you got the crew still got here. these. I mean, and they are really, really cool. So if you're looking for those, jump on live coal and beat. That is quite the attack group there. It sounds like a bunch of '90s bands. I know. Or 80 songs. I love this one with Oshawott. He literally is just beat. Like that's there's no no explanation. <laughs> Live coal as opposed to dead coal. Studio recorded coal. Stone cold. Adam coal. <laughs> bye bye. Okay. Well. <laughs> all right. It, <laughs> our little, you know, wrestling. Well, guys, we at least hope you enjoyed watching us not pull a whole lot. <laughs> it was new. We hadn't opened this yet. We have opened the paper one, but that was our first time with the actual lunchbox version. But we hope you like the video, subscribe, and check out our teaser for tomorrow's opening. Very excited.